So, with refreshing making constant videos that are changing the meta, you can expect to find some good ways to make money. Now, I know we all like to make money in this game, so I have an idea for you. With Refraction's latest video, a certain item was nerfed, making another item actually pretty useful now. Although it's only for later game players, people still want it. Now, there are four books that come from the Kuja boss fight. You have Strong Mana, Ferocious Mana, Mana Vampire, which is a pretty useful one, and Hardened Mana, which is not so useful. But the three books that are the most useful will make you the most amount of money. So yeah, let's look into this. But before we get deeper into this video, listen, I really want to go for 10k. You subscribing to the channel would really help me out. Because I am uploading more frequently, you can expect more giveaways. So go and join the Discord, there's a giveaway in there. About 10 to 50 mil coins, lasts about a week. Just join, go into giveaways channel and react. And also, leave a like. It really helps the channel and the algorithm. So yeah, let's talk more about these books. Now, of course, Ferocious Mana and Mana Vampire will make you the most amount of money. But strong mana still has its merits, as it is pretty useful nowadays. Alright, but before any of that, this video is timestamped, so if you just want to go straight to the profits, you can. But if you want to watch for more explanation, keep watching. Now, one thing you need to take into consideration is day and night cycles, and I mean in real life. Usually people don't pay attention to that, but at night time for me, is when I get the most flipping done. Now, by night time, I mean about 8pm EST. If you're not in the same time zone, you can go and translate it. Generally, this is when all the competition slows down. You're able to buy a lot of books, but before I go to sleep, I put a lot of books up to sell, and when I wake up, they usually sell. So you can either flip in the daytime when there's a lot of competition, or in the nighttime where it's more chill, you can buy more books and just put it up, come back tomorrow, and you're basically good. Now, I know you're curious on how Refraction had anything to do with this. Well, he did before. Not so much right now, but he still left a big impact on these books. Let me show you what I mean. First was the Mana Vampire book. I'm pretty sure this bug is still ongoing and you can heal infinitely basically with no mana. Now this made a huge impact on Mana Vampire books and back then this is when I made the most amount of money. Then Ferocious Mana was always good so I don't think he had much of an impact on that, but Strong Mana. In one of his recent videos, he basically made the admins cap Ferocious Mana and with that, people started using strong mana. That is why strong mana is somewhat useful now. Now, if you don't have a lot of money, I would recommend flipping strong mana all of the way. It's very cheap to flip and you can make from 1 to 2 mil profit every single time. So after all of that, let's see how much money we made. Before I say anything, I didn't record me buying any of the books. Although to show you I bought all of them, we can just go to high auctions. Now, this is my high auctions page. And as you can see, the amount of books I bought were just crazy. Like, I, I don't even know how much books I bought, to be honest. Now listen, all the books that I bought for under 300k were Mana Vampire, the books I bought for 400k and above were Ferocious Mana, and the books I bought for 100k were Strong Mana. So that's basically all you need. But the crazy thing is, most of the times, I ended up spending less than 300k for Mana Vampire books, as you can see right here. 190k, 155k, 299k, 200k, 244k, so yeah, I probably made way more profit than I'm going to calculate. Just for the sake of this video, I'm going to keep it at an average. We have 103 mil in my auction house, and I still have more books on my island that I bought, but we made enough profit, so I'll sell them later. Uh, the calculations are pretty simple, but I'm going to show you what I mean. But one thing I didn't show you. The average sell price. Now prices fluctuate all the time. As you can see, one, at one point I sell two of these books for eight mil, but at some points I sell them for six point five mil, and that is because I only spent two hundred k on the books. So once I sold it for above five mil, I made profit. Same with the ferocious mana. I bought it for four hundred k. Once I sold them for above six mil, I made profit. So that's basically it. Now the total profit. Now I'm going to say this right now. I probably made way more profit because I bought the books for less than I averaged out. So I'm just doing that to keep it nice and fair, but I know I made probably 10 mil more profit from that. But the total spend came up to 65 mil and 600,000 coins. Basically, it totaled me 37 mil profit in two hours. Now, this is the two hours I spent buying books. I just hopped on for like 10 minutes, bought books, put it on the auction house and logged off. Now, I could have done this way more than I wanted to, but I just didn't have time. So yeah, I am also going to give you some more tips at the end of this video because most of you won't know how to flip these books. Now, when this video does go out, you're gonna see a lot of books in the age, because after a while, the method will die down and you can make money again. But let me show you the best possible outcome and how much to spend on each book. Now, for Ferocious Mana, I would recommend spending no more than 400k. Most of the books are averaged out on 500k, 
but you will find books for 400k and if you manage to spend on only 400k for a book and the book starts selling for 9 mil you make about 3 mil profit per book now Mind of Vampire is the most profitable but tricky one. As you can see, they're 200k now, which you should buy these. If you were to buy them off for of 200k, you literally make almost about 3 mil profit. So that's really good. And these books sometimes go up a lot. Now, you won't always find it for 200k. Most of the times, you will find it for 300k. I would say buy it for 300k because you still will make profit. Now, Strong Mana. I wouldn't recommend spending more than 130k on these because Strong Mana doesn't sell for that much. But it is really good right now. But if you were to spend 200k on each book, you probably only make 400k. So if you spend 140k on each book, you make about 1.5 mil to 2 mil. But there is another pretty good way to make money now that most people don't do. And that's literally just regular books. Back then, in my older videos, I used to sell fully enchanted books and make a lot of money. And now, the same still applies. You can make up to 4 to 6 mil profit by selling these books. Now, remember, the update is coming soon, so you cannot waste time if you want to make money. But here's the gist of it. Right now, a fully, fully enchanted book is selling for about 8.8 .8 mil. And you can make this for about 5 mil. If you really want to make a lot of money, you can just sell these fully enchanted books and make so much much now back then these books used to make you so much money and right now they still can soul leader and legion right now a soul leader 5 is going for 28 mil and you can buy these for way cheaper and make so much money like right now even if you buy these books right now and merge all of them you will make profit it's the exact same with legion legion 5 is selling for 21 mil basically 22 and you can buy legion books for 1.1 mil getting you about 3 mil profit now i would flip these now but I know they'll sell, so there's no point in me flipping them. This is just to tell you, and this is just so you can make money. Now, I wouldn't recommend Overload. Because Overload doesn't sell quickly, it's going to be a pain to sell. But if you want to, if you want to take the risk, you can still sell these, as you still make a lot of profit from these. So yeah, that's basically all the books in a nutshell. Now remember, when updates drops, all of these books are going to be in the bazaar. So you won't be able to flip them as well as you could before. And it's pretty sad but you can still make money now while the books are in the auction house so i recommend you go into this now to make as much money as you can oh yeah i can't really show you because the alpha server right now isn't open so i can't show you the books being in the bazaar but i'm pretty sure there are videos out there that can show you just go on youtube search the new update and it should pop up so yeah i can't show you the alpha server is closed this video took a lot of editing and I would really appreciate it if you left a like and subscribe. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day, guys.